Welcome to Home TV. I'm Tracy Prees and here's what's happening in Northwestern Ontario today. The Disaster Recovery Assistance for Ontarians program, or the DRAO program, has been activated by the province of Ontario as of today for the Kenora and Rainy River districts. In the wake of the recent flooding and high waters, residents whose insurance coverage is insufficient or non-existent may apply for this assistance until October 7th, 2022. The program applies to primary residences and its basic contents, small businesses, farms, and not-for-profit organizations. The maximum funding per application is $250,000. There is a $500 deductible, but it may be waived for low-income households. Visit Ontario.ca to apply to the DRAO program. Also, please check in with your loved ones and other community members that may need some assistance with the online application. The City of Kenora has closed the following docks as water levels and accessibility are not safe. Anishinaabe Park, 7th Street South Dock, both Portage Bay and Kiwaitan River boat launches, the Kenora Recreation Centre middle loading dock, and some docks on Coney Island. North and middle docks remain open. Finally, if you're caught in Kenora by an OPP officer doing the right thing, you may get ticketed. This new initiative is geared towards youth and encourages good behaviour while no one is watching. Members of the OPP will be on the lookout and rewarding young people with positive tickets that include a voucher for a specific gift or a treat that can be redeemed at one of the following businesses, Lake of the Woods Chocolate Shop, Scoop Ice Cream, Coney Island Snack Shack, Sunset Bates, and Lake of the Woods Sports Headquarters. And that's your Home TV News Update for this hour. I'm Tracy Preece. Have a great day.